listening to us right now, Jerry Doggett of the Dodgers are, is doing an interview, but we're going to hear part of this conversation with Nolan Ryan. Did you feel the ball at Snowshoe hit in the seventh inning? He might find the gap. Well, uh, when he hit it, I thought it was hit high enough. I knew it wasn't out, and with Terry Speed out there, I really felt like he had a good shot at catching it. And the only ball hit well, I think, was Renicky's ball to Bill Billy. Yeah, and I got in on him, but he hit it down the line good. He said that uh, Tony was telling me that the fastest fastball he had today was 97 miles per hour. Well, I really didn't feel like I had exceptionally good velocity. I think that uh, the biggest thing I was able to get ahead with my curveball and move the ball in and out a lot. Ross, let me interject. Right. Ross Porter of the Dodger Broadcasting Crew has been interviewing Nolan Ryan, who's waited so patiently. Just a reaction from you. Sandy Koufax has four no hitters. You have broken it with number five, and a reaction to you at, when you threw that last pitch. Well, it, Tony, it was hard to believe that I finally accomplished it because I guess if there's one thing I wanted to do in my career was pitch that fifth one since I've had a shot at it, and I've had a shot at it for a long time. And at my age, I was really starting to think that I probably wouldn't get it because I've gotten into late innings before. Oh, in twice this year, I went into the seventh with no hitter going, and I just didn't seem to have that stamina that I used to have to put somebody away. And I think today uh, I felt stronger. I didn't strike a lot of people out in the later innings, but I tried to be a little finer. I didn't uh, I, I didn't challenge as many guys in the late innings as I had earlier. No, I want to talk about two specific guys. Bill Burden talked to us before the ball game, and he said that Mel Wright had worked with you so hard, and you had worked so hard to control the curveball. A comment on Mel Wright, your pitching coach, and also your catcher, Alan Ashby, who caught a beautiful ball game today. Well, Alan caught a, a, a great game. He was thinking right along with me. We didn't shake much at all. We threw a couple change up. They weren't working, so we just canned it. And on my curveball, Mel's worked with me, and I really think that the, that the key to me is getting my breaking ball over. You can't win with one pitch. You can't uh, 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 shut people out with one pitch because these guys, it's timing. They're fastball hitters. It doesn't matter how good a fastball you have, but if you have that breaking ball in there where they have to think about that and you can put that thought in your mind then you can get the fastball bound. Not only the superstition that goes along sometimes and maybe it's all hat with pitching a no hitter. You probably have been on the mound more than any pitch in the history of baseball when you've gone late in the ball game with a no hitter staring you in the face. What was going on in the bench. Well nobody really said anything to me and after the end of the eighth Don Sutton asked me if I was superstitious. I said no and he said, well, go put them away would you. And so uh, you know, basically, it's the same deal. The guys leave you alone. Uh, there's a lot of superstition in baseball, and it just worked out where uh, uh, I was uh, I was as fortunate to have enough stuff to, to go ahead and do it. When you left the bullpen before the ball game, well, let me let you introduce this young lady. Noli? My mother. This is Ryan. Is this, have you seen all of other, Noli's other uh, no-hitters? No, this is the first one. I know Noli's wife, Ruthie, came down in the field, gave him a big hug and kiss, but your grandchildren stayed at home. They did not see this no-hitter today. Yes, this was the day they all stayed home. <laughs> Nolly, when you left uh, left that mound, did you think you had no hit stuff down in the bullpen before no, the game today? I, I never really know before the game, and like I say, I was struggling with my delivery a little.